I'm going to show you how to take the Cal 3300 out of its housing. Uh, it can be a bit tricky and uh, you will need a screwdriver. Uh, you can get it under there, the front panel, and just wedge it out of there. Go from both ends. There we go. Wiggle it out. Can be a bit stiff. And then what we can do now is fit the RS485 comms board here. Comes in a packet. And we'll need to fit this riser first. So, uh, before we do this, you can see this is on an anti-static bag. Uh, you may want to discharge yourself. What I normally do is hold on to a bit of metal and then there's no possible uh, ESD. So we put the riser in like this. And in the tube screw the plastic nut on there here's the RS485 comms board and it should just slot on there and then we screw it down use the screwdriver the back of the riser you want to be careful here that you don't Scratch that main board with your screwdriver. Okay, that is. Yep, that's screwed on nicely. Okay, so there we go, that's, that's the RS485 board fitted. I'm going to screw it down more because it's just popped out when I. Yeah, there we go, let's screw it. Screw it in a bit better than that. Okay. So now we can just slot it back into 3300 holes in. There we go.